the Quebec you know, side of things needs to catch up a little bit. That's what some experts in the cannabis industry are saying after the government-run outlets in Quebec experienced a product shortage. I'm at Place Bonaventure in downtown Montreal at the first cannabis expo in Quebec where the room is filled with industry professionals. One of the topics of discussion, how to fill the shelves at this cannabis store on St. Catherine Street in downtown Montreal, one of the 12 across Quebec that will now be closing Monday through Wednesday. Some say the solution is issuing more licenses to produce cannabis. There are currently only 12 licensed producers in Quebec, compared to 69 in Ontario. There are currently many applications in, so as all of those get processed with all the verifications that are required and the licenses get granted, uh, we'll definitely be able to increase the capacity throughout Canada. Like Neptune, Canara is also in the final stage of acquiring their license from Health Canada. They say they have already spoken with the SQDC and they expect to begin supplying stores in early 2019. I know a facility like ours can produce around 10,000 kilos a year and I think that would give a good push to the, the supply agreement right now with the SQDC. Wolf estimates that those 10,000 kilos, which equate to 10 million grams, could be enough to supply a single SQDC store for an entire year. Having more licensed producers is just one of the solutions to improving the industry in Quebec. The transport companies are here, the licensed producers are here, they can meet, they can work things out, they can make sure that, uh, you know, they work well together so that the chain keeps going and the product is on the shelves. City News approached Hexo and Aurora, two of the SQDC's largest suppliers, to find out more about the shortage. Both declined our request for an interview. Turgeon believes the expo will help the industry progress in Quebec. The event will happen annually, and next year's date has already been set for the 3rd and 4th of October, again at Place Bonaventure. In Montreal, Giordano Cescuti, City News.